privilege for us to be able to pray with the Holy Father in the middle of us. The arrival of the Pope for World Youth Day, a moment for which thousands of young people in Panama had been waiting. What a day. And it happened in Panama last year, World Youth Day. Panama is a beautiful city and the friendliest of people. It's famous, of course, for its canal. Panama is situated between North and South America at its narrowest point. But it's a long way from the UK. Young people came from all over, though most were from Central and South America. It was great to be there. Everyone was friendly. Lots of photos. Thousands of young people gathered for the vigil. Several hundred came from the UK, from different dioceses. We spent the night sleeping out under the stars. The next day, more young people arrive and the excitement mounts. Always time for photos. As the young people waited, they were entertained with music, loud music. People waved flags from all over the world. As we awaited, the popes arrived. The excitement mounted and the music got louder. Here we see a group from Brazil. We see one of the screens. The band was great. Soon the Pope would arrive. Here friendships were made. Then the moment everyone had been waiting for. The Pope was given such a great welcome. Every young Catholic should try to go to World Tuesday. Day. The next day, there was another great day, especially for us Carmelites, the 4th International Carmelite Youth Day. Oh, what a day! What joy being with your Carmelite family. The day began at our Carmelite Church in Panama City. Here we see the statue of Our Lady giving the scapula to St. Simon Stock, a medieval English Carmelite. During World Youth Day, people left hundreds of petitions at the foot of the cross asking our Lord to intercede for them and for others. It was touching to see. The day began in the pastoral center beside the church. We had first to register and then queue for breakfast. Arrivals will pass the statue of Our Lady of Mount Carmel. They came in ones and twos, sometimes more. Soon the numbers started to build up. We see a group from Venezuela sit down together. young friars pose with the friend. Here we see some young Carmelites from Colombia. Written on their t-shirts is Carmelita Soy. I am a Carmelite. Here's a young Carmelite from El Salvador. And here are four more young Carmelites from El Salvador. Young Carmelites from Peru proudly hold their national flag. Here we see the logo of the two orders of Carmel. We read, Carmel is all Mary's. Both the heads of the two orders were there. It was good to be together. 
a group of young Carmelites from Nicaragua sing a hymn to Our Lady of Mount Carmel as we prepare for the procession. <laughs> One of our friars sings another hymn to Our Lady. procession will start. At last the procession starts. It will go through the streets of Panama to a hotel about one mile away. wends its way through the streets. There are about 500 mostly young people. As we process, so we recite the rosary in different languages. Bless her no among women, and bless is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. A poster by a bus stop welcoming Pope Francis. The streets are busy again, but the people of Panama were so welcoming and friendly. Eventually, we arrive at Hotel Rio. At first, it looks like chaos, but it's organized chaos. The day was in fact very well organized with food and entertainment and finishing with mass. Always lots of fun. Here we see traditional folk dancing from Guatemala. The dresses are so beautiful and colourful. Then it was turned for more dancing. The band was lively and the music loud. The dancing went on for ages. The band leader asks, Are you tired? To which they reply, No! And so it went on. So that was our Carmelite, International Carmelite Youth Day. And what a day it was! What a fantastic experience. Unfortunately, we got to wait till 2023 for the next one in Lisbon, Portugal but it'd be worth waiting for. Now, if you're aged between 18 and 13 and 30 and might like to know more about Carmel, Carmelite family, Carmelite youth, Carmelite spirituality, then please do get in touch and maybe we can organize something together 
bring a crowd of Carmelite youth to, to Lisbon and celebrate there, it will be an experience you'll never forget, I, I can assure you. So uh, do, do look at the, the details, contact details on the screen. Okay for now. God bless you. Bye-bye.